Welcome back to Let's Play the Anna for Two Truth. So, some of you might maybe post a comment or something that I'm missing a fabric. Yeah, you see, that's the door over there. There we go, now we got the fabric. Yeah, it's a funny thing, I missed a fabric. I missed one in the previous playthrough. So anyway, let's go back to Telenor. So, off screen I um, played um, Mr. Emery's game. So I could um, get the tokens, have 1,340. And let's get Adjub's ring. Nine of Swords raises attack and luck by three. The strength learns the searing edge skill. And the captains. Large shade favor by ship's captains. Lar Big Liz block in the wind. Eileen really likes these. So yeah, Eileen, that's an item that can only be worn by Eileen. Nice, I got Adjub's ring. Yeah, unfortunately we can't equip it on um, Eileen because it removes the party members when we enter. So we have the captains. And we're going to equip the whiskers. The whiskers, it does slightly decrease attack, but it increases agility and luck. So I'm going to put that on. Okay, so the captain's um increases slightly increases by one of every stat except for HP, CP, and attack. And that's what it looks like on her. And I chose the pirate outfit for Zara. So let's go down. Ahoy! Ah, you really got it. Thank you, Lassies. I'm truly grateful to ye. Ugh. Yeah, yeah, hand over the reward. <laughs> Hope you like it. What the hell? Oh. No! Seriously, what's this? And this is what the graphic, lo the bus graphic looks like when Eileen's wearing Artis's garb outfit. Fine. <sighs> yeah, I didn't realize that, but you have to, um purchase the ring if you reset the side quest. So let's go to Capilet. And we have every art. We have every guard. So you should have nine of them if everything is collected. Let's start with um, Celeste's outfit. Journalist's attire. Huh. Mm. What, you don't like it? No. It's not that. It's just not what I expected. Of course. What were you expecting? Yeah. I don't know, maybe some fuzzy slippers? Okay. So the fabricated outfit is a bit different. So in so a bit of exchange for um so exchange for lower luck by fourteen, you get higher magic attack. So I guess the fabricate is a bit similar to like the casual it, which where the casual slightly increases attack, agility, and luck, but in exchange we get lower defense and magic. Probably, um, yeah, pretty quick to made outfit. Oh yeah, I actually, um, did some off-screen fix, so now we only have one copy of Liliana's clothes.
Adventurer suit. I guess it was getting a bit chilly. Yeah, yeah looking cool, Aiden. Obviously. Huh, well, yeah. I'm not sure why, but something about Zelda seems really fitting to me. Ah. It does fit you pretty well, yeah. In fact, it doesn't leave much imagination at all. <laughs> huh? That's not what I meant. Hmm. Okay, so the fabricated outfit for Aiden. So the fabricated alpha slightly decreases defense and luck, but increases uh, magic attack and magic defense. And they, yeah, they have, um, yeah, pretty much the same abilities. So ours is garb. And... This one's pretty funny. Huh? Ah. My hair! How did it do that? Ah. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. It's it is not cool. I don't want pink hair. I like my hair the way it was before. Hey! Having pink hair isn't so bad. And anyway, it's just hair clips. You can take them all take them out anytime. Oh. oh. Yeah, Eileen. Okay, so the, um... So the fabricated garb, yeah, does slightly... Yeah, it does decrease the CP there. Yeah, it does have a bit of decrease to um, HP and CP. And a slight decrease of joy and luck, but we do get um improved... Some slightly improved... Defense and magic defense, if you get better magic attack. And I believe that, of course, can be fixed with the priestly staff. Queen Fragelia? That one needs three instead of six. What? What? What is this? I thought this machine was supposed to make improved copies of clothes, not make them worse. Um, maybe this machine, maybe the machine malfunctioned. But... There's no way I can wear this. Well, nothing we can do about it now. So dancer garb. So the fabricated queen one, um, yeah, boosts up the um, HP and attack, but we do get a bit decrease to um, defense. I think it's about one fourth of, yeah, about one fourth of the hate of our defense there. We do get a slight decrease of magic defense and luck, but we do get a good decrease of agility. So for the hero's dress. I'm great hero's dress. Huh? Um, um, I'm taking this off. No. Oh, come on, I think it's... What? What, you think it's what? Um, I was gonna say cute, but... Sorry. But you uh, kind of look like you're about to kill me, so... <laughs> Never mind. Yeah, she doesn't like the hero's dress. So the fabricated dress, um... Yeah, it decreases, um, defense, bad defense, and luck, but you do get a good buff of attack.
entertainer's uniform. I suppose this is definitely an improvement. I think it looks pretty cool. If I were you, I'd be hopping a joy. Hey. Do you get it? Because Enough. I get it. Yeah, of course, Kai. Okay, so the fabricated outfit does decrease her CP, but you get a good improvement of HP. And we do lose a bit of magic attack and look, but we get more defense and agility in exchange. And this is the final outfit. What's the point of this mask? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Well, I mean it's not like it really hides about dinner or anything. And when eyes can Pretty clear to see who I am, even with it on. Ah. Maybe it's just because it looks cute. <laughs> I sh it should at least be functional. Don't worry so much. Yeah, yeah, his functions look cute. <laughs> if you say so. So the fabricated thieves. It creases. Um. It increases defense and luck by 6, agility by 10, but slight magic defense decrease. Alright. There we got everything. So that's everything. So there's a side quest we gotta do. And do a side quest, we gotta go over here. Oh well, if it isn't Miss Show Off and her gang of show offs. Nice one, Bruce. Uh hi. Did you need something? Yeah, actually, since you're such an expert at whole bounty hunting things, we got another slippery run for you to track down. The thief has been breaking, entering all over town. By examining their pattern, we feel pretty confident that we know where to strike next. Well, if you know where they're gonna be, then what do you need my help for? Er, well... You did such a good job last time, so we thought we could just give you the intel and... So you're lazy, got it. Ahem, anyway. And the house is just south of here. According to what we know, the thief should be there soon. I assume I'll get paid for this. Yes, yes, plenty of gold will be waiting for you upon your return. Now go on. They could show up any minute. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the um quest hints this. Plenty of gold. So we just go to that door that is. So that door that's now open. Okay, okay. Ah! Hmm. Yeah, there's also a chest. I think it might appear time? Ed Truth, maybe? A pair of Princess Erony. Looks like they assigned by an arson in Garden Age, so let's use a cube for herself. Here's this hit in critical rate. Yeah, cruisers are hit in critical rate. Which I guess that would be a bit of a usual alternative. You probably lose your 
feed. First, we're going to keep it. All right. There doesn't seem to be anyone here. Maybe the thief went upstairs. Stop right there, thief. Huh? There she is, boss. We told you she'd be here. Excellent work, boys. I'm impressed you managed to pinpoint the exact time your little thief would turn off his well. Seems like the three of you have really, really turned your act around. <laughs> right, you're under arrest for breaking the entering, young lady. Wait, that's not... And they're tying me up despite the fact that they hired me. And I'm dressed as a royal guard. Hmm. Is it just me or does she seem familiar? Oh, well, of course she's familiar. Er, no idea what you're talking about. Hmm? Better go ahead and cover her eyes too as extra precaution. Hmm, as you say. Oh, you're struggling, little lady. Little lady. You're getting locked up for a long time. Take her away, boys. Not such a hot shot now, are you? It won't be making us look bad like that ever again. Huh? They set me up? Let's go. <laughs> really? Doubt to keep you still until we can trench in a more secure location. Hmm? Eh, it's no use struggling or calling for help. You should have fought twice before crossing us. What's going on? I can't believe this. I have to get out of here. Disable self-discipline. <laughs> oh, nothing useful. Okay, at least we get the force off. Yeah, should be tiles play. <gasps> Escape successful. You am free. I should get out of here. I think that guard's gone to this us. Okay, do we ever fought him? There's a oh. Time to get serious. Yeah, I did not know he's got a science destroy. Special triple strike. Looks like that bandit we just beat. I think we might have fought that guard, but yeah, that guard is the Capilla guard. And yeah, that's the, um, yeah, I believe that's the bandit from the Bounty Hunter quest. Okay, so you also have a narrow way to a um, little... Hmm. Okay, I believe we 
point to just go straight in here. Hey, you! Wait, let me explain. I see. Now that you mention it, I do remember you, but you're that girl turning that band chief would have been chasing. All my deepest apologies, long, young lady. Young lady. I'll see that my soft words are sufficiently punished for the trouble they caused you. In here, take this. It's the least I can do. To think that they would go this far for revenge. I guess they're tired because a girl's but a woman is better. All right, now we can open this chest. And the four coins. Okay, I think we're gonna switch to um, Liana. Our next task is to head back to um, Upper Prawn. Huh? And let's read all the news. So it's 15. Governor of Scarred House funding to increase. Governor of Scarred. This sucks! We're funding. These ass. They framed me and had me arrested. That's not. definitely no way to treat a heroic bounty hunter. Whatever. But yeah, stupid, right? Mommy walks no more. Who's found the mummy? On the outside mall. Yeah. I heard there's two mummies actually. No. Celeste. Indeed. I did not mind that one. And I guess like um she wears that outfit. I think regardless what you have equipped. I think I think it does override the gym. A guy for safe travel to Malas, a hottest vacation spot of the year. Probably could have used this for a sneak board at ship and ended up at that slaver camp. You have my thanks. I I do all my thanks. I'm here to help. I, it was no trouble at all, really. You've gotta be kidding me. No trouble at all, says who? You were wrong. It was quite troublesome. Um well, it all quite worked out, didn't it? Yes. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Next time, you get to be a bait. Group I have core for myth or OP bow body. I really wish I had more. Even Zoro is no match for hmm. it. Something in your mind, Celeste? No! Oh. Pleasure girl on the base has room or a partition range. That's terrible! Partition? How scandalous. Um You really can't believe everything you read, Eileen, hmm? huh? Hopes to expand library to increase tourism and business. Has a long way to compete Avaron. Hmm. Maybe I should check out more closer next time we're there. Yes. It's not nearly as big as Alvarana, but as plenty of heterogram books. Sorry. I think I'll Why? pass. What how come? Uh... Let's just say I'm not a huge fan of local patrons. There have been whispers of a minutes burning teddy bears and pin dragon. Who would do something like that? Why? And Don't why? Worry so much. I think some of those things happen to bad people. Seriously? Well, it's not suspicious. We are fake. Can you spawn again near Pendragon? Yeah. That's why I'm saying Kintsune around here, too. <laughs> yeah, she's a cutie. I guess. It's comfortable, okay? You beginning. Pretty little Liliana's coop. A new beginning. Pretty little coop of the Huso cancels us all. Uh, a coop, really? It's all right. It's all right, Celeste. Huh? But fine. Don't worry. Not all coops are bad, right, Lily? Certainly. Indeed. Obviously. But they're not all good, right, Zara? Oh. No. I just say it's a matter of perspective. You've got to be kidding. Gotta be kidding me. Out of tune and out of time. Patience reference, local cute player. 
This has gone a lot better. Has she? Well, the scene could use a lot, could use a bit of work. Ruffian Dan's troop exposes slavers after more ignorant tours fall victim. Sorry. In their defense, they were pretty convincing, but it definitely worked out in the end. Uh... Princess Leon's Raw Knight. Detail on her high name is Resident and Pendragon. Uh... Ah, where did she hear Don't this? Worry. It says here from reliable yeah. sources. You can always talk to Paige to set the record straight. But, but I. No comment. I really don't think she remembered yeah. much anyway. I actually say someone else had much more magical night. Okay. It's just a gym of illusion. Missing deviation. Could Oz Sports Therapy the real deal? She absolutely is not the real deal. Won't try to have us auctioned off. Yeah. How about we tell Paige to write about that instead? Ugh. At least she tells people to be careful. Blah shop on our loss at the banners breaking the warehouse to rearrange merchandise. Also, steal one arm of clothing. Yeah. Oh yeah. I remember that. It was like a puzzle drive to figure out how to slide all those crates. Yeah. yeah. Even I was having trouble with deciding where to move airfield. Mm -hmm. Do you think perhaps we shouldn't have done that? What do you mean? No. I mean, maybe we shouldn't have broken into someone's property and taken their stuff. What's your problem? Is it really, really breaking in that the door was unlocked? What? Well, how about the second door? Don't worry so much. Well, we had a key for that one. Um... Besides, we really worked hard for it. The fox, the boxes were really heavy and stuff. What? I don't see the problem. Well, obviously, don't little Miss Capomatic. <laughs> <laughs> Certainly. Kai, you certainly know where I'm coming from, right? Um, Kai? indeed. I think sometimes the end justifies the mean. <laughs> Kai. <laughs> Apparently, yeah, they got upset because you broke into there. Not to be on time about Kent Melody's prison appointments. Pendragon prison introduced paid villain. Phew. Are you stupid? Okay, that must be a unique sound effect. That would be a serious thing you wasted our money on. What? I was just curious. I want to see what it was. Foolish. You return multiple times. Sorry. Prisoners are always different. It was addicting. <laughs> okay. Open travel menu. Okay, we gotta go to the castle gates. Good to see you again, Captain. Alright, hey, soldier. Right, I still haven't gotten used to that. We see a troubling report from the current research center. It seems that there's been some kind of break in. I'm told that the staff have been subdued by intruders. Well, I leave for five minutes and everything hits the fan. Typical. What do you know about these intruders? Not much, though, but according to the report, at least one of them was a proficient ion. Has anyone gone there to take care of it? Not yet, Captain. Should I dispatch a squadron? No offense, but I don't trust exactly Royal exactly trust Royal Nice and a hostage situation. I feel much better if we just went and dealt with ourselves. Hmm. Well the truth is all of our best men are out of our science at the moment. Ugh. Well in that case, the best aid Aiden is right. We'll take care of it. I'll let everyone know. Best of luck, Captain. Yeah, and we just merged the Celeste. Hmm. I am pretty sure you can guess who that Ion is. Oh, yeah. Now, something interesting. There's actually some sort of bug I discovered in um, Truth. If the... Um, 
Like, if you have no talking part to active in the once, I believe you reach like, I think some point of like chapter 19 or epilogue act four. Hmm. Yeah, this kind of messes up the game. I think it's because they both take place in the CRC. Hmm. Don't think I've ever been here. Big building. I'll be happy to give you a tour, but let's take our tours first. Yeah, come on, guys. There's no time to lose. And I'm gonna get Eileen's ready. It's sitting mist. You'll see why I have our outfit equipped. Ah. Uh. So all the people are tied up, but the ones are knocked out. To our stats, it would seem. So it's like a big... Oops. Oh, eat company. Oh. What unfortunate timing. Seriously? Wait a minute, Evelyn? And Carol too? <gasps> hmm, why am I just an afterthought? Hey! Why are you two doing here? Obviously. Isn't it obvious? They're the ones who broke in and did all this. Mm. Let's not get excited. Carol and I were just visiting. <laughs> That doesn't look like casual tourism. Well, okay, we got a little overzealous, but when we heard about the big crystal, we just had to. Yeah, that's the Chroma Spring. I see. Heard from where exactly? Carol, that's enough. We're not talking our way out of this. I'm afraid to left us no choice. That's no fun. Oh, fine. Sorry, guys. I feel I like it all, but this isn't personal. I'll be okay. Thank you. We got spring breeze. Oh. I'll hurt you if I have to. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're gonna focus our attack. I can help too. I'm gonna focus on. You're nothing. They do insane damage. Mm. Oh. Sorry. Okay, we got five of them tied up. Yeah, I think that was a strike. Let's do ransom. Got 250 G. Spring Breeze. I can 
keep going. Try to rescue all. Oh. oh, that's a good amount of HP. Okay, okay. Storm crystal. So that's the last crystal we got. Storm crystal. Level 55. Level 55. Mm, good. Problem solved. Yeah. We better start untying everybody. I guess. I guess we better get these two back at the capital. Mm -hmm. Idiots. Yes, well, you should have thought, thought of that before you decided to take a bunch of hostages. Um, Celeste? Mm. I just don't understand why they do this. Indeed. They will confess before long. The real nice will be sure of that. Yeah. Yeah, but I think we should hear them out. Hear them out ourselves first. They did help us before, after all. And I have a hard time believing they meant they meant to hurt oh. anyone. So you tend to interrogate them here? Mm -hmm. hmm. There are cells in the facility, are there not? Well. That's true. They are. I suppose we what? could. But why? They're just gonna wind up at Elverona Dungeon's either way. I can do this. Maybe. But we should at least give them a chance to explain ourselves. I think we owe them that much. Hmm. Whatever you say. Very well. In the case, I suppose we separate them and speak with them one at a time. Okay. Good idea. Hey. Hey, could you help us get these two situated in separate cells? I wanted to ask him some questions before we take them back to Everona. Yeah. Really? Okay. Okay, let's do this. If I may offer a word of advice, Carol seemed more forthcoming than her companion, so perhaps it would be wise to start with her. That's a good point. And then we gotta remove the gag. Ready to talk yet? Hmm, not yet. Okay, so we just keep. Look, if you don't tell me why you two did all this, I'm gonna have to turn you over to Royal Knights, and they're not gonna be as nice as I am. Good, maybe we get someone who actually knows how to treat me right. What? Did you hear me? I said they're not gonna be as nice as me. I heard what you said.
Let's see if that loosens your tongue. Harder. What are you serious, he? So he just keeps seducing. All right. This is your last warning. Okay, okay, this is fun, but I guess it's about time to stop messing around. Finally. Uh. Does that mean you're ready to tell me the truth? Well. well, actually, I don't think I'm gonna be able to. What do you mean? Hmm. I like it all, but I wouldn't feel right telling you guys everything unless everyone agrees. <sighs> Look, oh. hold on, I have an idea. Evelyn might be a little tricky to convince, but I think it would. It could be done. She might act like she's cool and collected, but truth is, she's pretty easy to okay. foster. I'm listening. <laughs> So the first thing is, you need to get her blushing. I mean, blushing. If you can do that, she'll be easier to talk to. Um, if you're saying, if I embarrass her enough, then she'll answer my questions. Nope. Not quite. Once she's good and embarrassed, you just need to ice on the cake. <laughs> Tell her that you know about self bondage innocence. What? The self bondage innocence? I'm not sure I... Yeah. Just trust me. She'll know what it means. Once she hears that, I feel pretty confident that she'll agree to tell you everything. Um, I guess there's no harm in at least giving it a try. Fine, if you say so. And there's the AC rope. Okay, before we do... Go to the... So, Storm Crystal. So I lied, I said the Ice Crystal was the last one. It converts the damage, fire and gale types. Oh, super heat, double shot, flame for a hot air beam. Heavily damaged in one enemy twice of fire chroma. Or by you do need 50 CP. Yeah, that's a lot. Heavily damaged is only with a fire chroma, but you need 40 CP. Yeah, that's a lot of MP. It blasts enemy a hot wind chroma, but lowers all enemy agility of four turns. And that's 25 CP. They all need 10 CP. Excuse me. So that's pretty... Yeah. I don't know if that still will help later in the game when they can attack quickly. So we need to reboot the gag. Ready to talk, Cat? I told you, it's got to have information. So yeah, we saw Carol and Apple. And, yeah, something that's interesting. A lot of people did not know what her outfit's supposed to look like until the Dapper 2. Which would be confirmed that this would be the outfit. I don't think it does anything. So. You really don't want to talk, cause if you don't, because uh, if you won't tell you guys we're doing here, I have to turn over all nights. I'm sorry, I simply can't. Why not? Our mission is for the upward support of security. I won't betray my employer. Who's your employer? Let me guess. Is that Leroy? Is it when I tell you how pretty you are? I wish I had a boy as nice as yours. I'm not interested in your empty fiery. Oh jeez. Tickle. Whatever you're ticklish, ha ha ha. Take this, yes. Until we get. I want to get her up. Ouch, Tishan, I thought you were a good person. Says so the girl broke into research facility and tied a bunch of researchers. Touche. I think we just keep using seduce and... Yeah, blackmail. So it's not convince information, it's now blackmail. Look, Evelyn, if you don't tell me what I need to know, then I'm going to have to start telling people about the South Bunch Innocence. The... Wait, what? How do you? Carol, but she's sure she... Never. Yeah, well, she told me everything, and I'm gonna start telling everyone too, unless... No, stop. Okay, fine. Fine. 
Please just don't humiliate, humiliate me like that again. Not again. Jeez, whatever happened. It must have been pretty embarrassing. Carol and I were sent here from Naraconda. Whole ocean array from Idra. Which, you bitch, if you play Danny Napper, you would know that as the kingdom. Our task was to investigate a strange force called Kurma that seemed to exist here. And discover if it was any different from what we refer to as magic, where we come from. Huh. So where'd it come from? I see. Well, you told us back in Malatina that it was the same thing. It's complicated. It appears that way, but we're not sure. We are having trouble getting anywhere with our research. I even sent Carol to the library to see if she could find any books on the subject, but... Well, you know how that turned out. However, while Carol was there, she did learn about this place, the Kurma Research Center. We thought that we would be able to learn more by coming here. However, it was close to outside visitors, so we had to force a way in. Well, of course, that's understandable, but in reality, the CRC only allows authorized people to enter. As we um learn in Chapter 11. Yeah. I see. But why didn't you just ask us for help? Aiden works here, so she could have probably just pulled some strings to let you guys in. Well, That's true, but like I said, our mission was supposed to be a secret. I shouldn't even be telling you what I told you now. Had we asked you for help, you certainly would have asked us why we want to come here so badly. We couldn't take that risk. Okay. I just have one more question. The employer that you guys keep mentioning, who is it? You wouldn't know her. Wait, so that's not, so it is not a, um, man. It doesn't say who the character is. <sighs> I still don't even know who it is. Sorry about that. I'm sorry, that's one thing I simply can't say. Um, I suppose it would be too much to ask for you to let us go. Um, er, well, the thing is, you guys did commit a lot of crimes to break in here. And as Captain Royal Guard, I would be failing my duty if I didn't bring it in. I see. Sorry. I'll talk to the Arvors and see what they think at least. Mm. Very well. Yeah, it doesn't mention who that person yeah. is. Maybe it's Suki, but... So how'd it go? <laughs> I got to tell me everything, well mostly, you see. Hmm. How intriguing. I wonder if there are any difference between our magic and our chrome. Whatever. As interesting as it might be, they still did break the law. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> Personally, I don't find explanation satisfactory enough reason to release yes. them. Yeah, I agree. Certainly. And at the very least, we should bring them back to Everon and give them a fair trial. Ugh. I guess you're right. I just feel bad. Are all the researchers okay? Yeah. Yeah. I feel minor cuts and bruises, but no one is much worse for wear. Good. Very well. I believe that things are mostly clean, cleaned up around here, so perhaps you and I could prepare these two for transfer back to Avarana, Celeste. Okay. Good idea. The rest of us will make sure the ship is ready for them. Well, shall we? Yeah. Right, I'll... Huh? So let's look out. And... Not in the bands of tie of both Celeste and Liliana. Hmm. Come on, aren't you gonna at least say thanks? You could at least escape anytime you want. Couldn't you have? <laughs> oh, Evie, you know me too well. Hello. You didn't have to wait so That's long. No fun. Well, no reason to have a little fun first. Uh... Fun? You never cease to be aware of me, and I can't believe you told her about the self punch innocent after you oh. promised. Oh, about that. I didn't actually tell her anything. Hey, hey. <laughs> I glare at her later. Let's slip up before the rest of them come back. Fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, it cute. looks. Oh, it looks so cute together. Carol, Carol focus. Hmm. Sorry. What are you doing? Just, I just feel a little bad, so I'm leaving them present. Carol, I don't have. Time to goof around, let's go. Just one second. All right, off we go. Yeah, so we did not capture them. Hey. 
Alright, hey, are you two coming or... Oh, great. I assume they escaped. Yes. Looks that way. Fine. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Ugh. Damn it, she used some tre cheap trick on us. I apologize. Just the false one. I should have noticed that she loosed our box. You know where they went? No. no. Damn it. And she swore again. Hmm. Should we try to look for them? No. No, I think we can let this one go. I was worried for a second. I wouldn't have felt bad arresting them anyway. Yes. True. Uh, what's this? Yeah. It seems like they left a note. Let me see. What's this? What does it say? Sorry, cues. No hard feelings. Blah, blah, XOXO. Must be from Carol. Um. Uh, anyway, looks like she left something else. In a Nava wand. Mm -hmm. Well, for better or worse, I suppose that's that. <laughs> Indeed. All right. So I think that's probably nearly all the side quests in um, yeah, 1.1. So now we're going to tackle the new truth site quests. Which we're going to start at CRC. So I'll return, excuse me, so I'll return back here. And, okay, good, it healed us. Yeah, so I'm going to return back here and do a special side quest. Which I'll show you when we get there. 